Well, medical debt is a major issue across the U.S., and many people find themselves paying bills that they shouldn't be paying. Ivan Adetta spoke with the Consumer Financial Protection Bureau to understand why this is happening. Well, Ivan, how is the CFPB working to protect patients from unfair practices? Good afternoon, Stephanie. The CFPB reports thousands of complaints each year about medical debt collection, with many of these debts wrongfully charged. But the CFPB is taking steps to help those who need it most. Whether the debt was paid off, should have been covered by insurance, or falls under charity care, some patients are finding themselves hounded by debt collectors. Many of these complaints are coming from people who don't actually owe the debt, whether it was paid by insurance, by the patients themselves, or whether it should have been paid by financial assistance. Nonprofit hospitals required by law to offer charity care are not always providing that assistance to low-income patients, leaving them with bills they can't pay. In response, the CFPB has proposed new rules to ban credit reporting for medical debts, a common tactic used by debt collectors to pressure people into paying bills even if they don't owe the money. We've already seen some action by the National Credit Reporting Agency to start to take larger debts off of people's credit reports, and that's having a positive impact for people. But our research suggests that we need to go farther. But that's not the only problem. Medical credit cards are often offered as a solution to pay these bills advertised with zero interest promotions. However, many patients struggle to pay off their balance before the high interest rates kick in, trapping them in more debt there's virtually no way for a person to actually pay off what they owe during that zero interest period. And once that period ends, they end up paying much, much higher interest on their medical bills. The CFPB is trying to make it easier for patients to dispute these debts by taking away the coercive tools debt collectors use. Proving that you don't owe a bill can be an uphill battle and often patients aren't given the time to sort out these errors. We're removing the kind of coercive pressure that debt collectors can put on people by threatening to report an unpaid debt to a credit reporting agency. That'll give people a little bit more time. The CFPB is continuing to work with other government agencies to pressure nonprofit hospitals to better comply with charity care requirements and give patients the assistance they need before their bills go to collections. And patients should ask about charity care options before agreeing to any payment plan or medical credit card. Always check bills for accuracy and don't be afraid to dispute those charges. And for more resources on disputing medical debt, which happens a lot, you can submit those complaints to the CFPB. And you can also head to consumerfinance.gov to submit those complaints. And Stephanie, I actually put out a feeler on Facebook mm -hmm. to see how many people are actually struggling with this kind of debt. And yeah. a lot of people did chime in and say, I'm having this issue where I paid it or it should have been covered already and I'm still getting bills for this. So yeah, yeah it's not great. So <laughs> not when you great. were talking about uh, a new rule kind of banning credit reporting for this kind of debt, that would, yes. that would help a lot of these people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because a lot of these uh, the debt collectors like to kind of threaten you and say, hey, we're going to put this on your credit report. So that's what the CFPB is trying to stop. So th it's, a, it's a good idea for consumers. Of course, maybe the medical debt collectors might not like it, but the consumers will definitely enjoy something like this. And definitely check out the CFPB website if you are needing to submit a claim or anything like that if you're dealing with this issue. Yeah, that can be very worrisome. Yes, yes. <laughs> Thank, <laughs> All you, right. Thank you so much.